want to be big on this big, uh, story that's coming in. Remember, he has to appear before the Delhi court. Was he unnecessarily holding hands of these young women wrestlers, some of them even below 18 years of age? Was there inappropriate touching? Was there groping of private parts? Was there intimidation and more? Amid all of these testimonies and allegations, comes in Bridgebhushan Sharan Singh's defense. He says that uh, this is absolutely not possible. I was never alone, never met female wrestlers alone. My security always accompanies me. Remember, he's also a BJP member of parliament. He's also a wrestling federation chief. So there is a certain security, as he claims, is around him that we've also seen often when he travels from one location to another. But he claims that because the security is always around me, how can that happen? Now look closely on the photograph on his screen. He's standing, holding hands of a young woman wrestler and these are one of the pictures that have been submitted as evidence to say that there was this unnecessary inappropriate touching that was being done and this was just a part of a lot of other kinds of harassment that the young women wrestlers faced. Uh, so this, could it be enough evidence to nail him, to be able to put him behind bars or will he get away citing this is no evidence, these are all baseless allegations against him. For now, Bridgebhushan Sharan Singh is also preparing a defense to say, I never meet female wrestlers alone. I'm always accompanied by my security, so how is that possible? And this also, and what I'm telling you is quoting from the chart sheet. So apart from the testimonies and the witnesses who've been recorded, 108 individuals recorded, wrestlers have been recorded as statements, Bridgebhushan Sharan's statement also has been recorded by the Delhi police. Nitin Srivastav is joining me now in this uh, morning telecast. He closely tracks the sports fraternity, has been able to speak to Bridgebhushan Sharan Singh over the past few months as well. Nitin, what should one make of the defense of Bridgebhushan Sharan Singh right now? It is he said who said, but it is also eventually about evidence, not just testimonies that will be able to nail Bridgebhushan Sharan Singh. Well, Pooja, the chart sheet we, which we have accessed, uh, and that, that chart sheet is clearly saying that uh, there are several instances where uh, female wrestlers uh, were actually uh, <coughs> harassed, uh, and uh, they have uh, they have mentioned that what exactly they have gone through in last uh, 10 to 12 years. But on the other hand, whenever you ask Bridgebhushan Saran Singh, he will he will clearly say that uh, I have not done anything wrong. I am clean. And I will, I will prove this in court. And that is what uh, Bridgebhushan Saran is maintaining actually. And today he will be appearing in front of court and uh, his defense is ready. Because yesterday only when I asked uh, uh, him that what exactly that you are planning for. Because there is a chart sheet which is, which is saying a long uh, tale about the harassment. There are six wrestlers who, who were maintaining the, the same stand that uh, uh, you uh, harassed all the uh, female wrestlers in the different different locations, be it uh, international tours, be it uh, national uh, tournaments, be it uh, Olympic qualification, be it uh, uh, just a trial. Uh, there are several instances that is what they are talking about and police has mentioned all the statements in the chart sheet and on the other hand that you have maintained it very clear that I have done, not done anything wrong. So how exactly you are going to fight it against in the courts? He said, see, I'm, I, I believe in court and my uh, legal team is ready. I will see what can be done in the court and I will abide by the court. Whatever court will say, I will abide by. All right, Nitin Srivastava will be tracking the latest on this big story. So our uh, colleagues are tracking the legal fraternity. Srishti Oja will be at the Delhi court where Bridgebhushan Sharan Singh has to appear. Remember, what we are tracking today is not just about Bridgebhushan Sharan Singh. It's also about the wrestling federation and it's also about the wrestling sport. But above all, it is about the future of young girls who want to make it big in the sport of wrestling. And they should not feel disheartened by what's been happening. They need to be inspired. They need to know an example is set and that justice prevails. I'm wrapping up this bulletin for now. Thank you so much for watching. Keep tracking and stay tuned to India Today Television. Have a great day. Thank you very much.